You can also easily add a cloud storage account inside of Adobe Acrobat Reader and then save your files there directly. So to do that, I'm going to go around onto the left side and here you can see that I can click on add an account. So once I do that, I have an option to add in a cloud account of my choice. Like you can use Box, you can use Dropbox, Google Drive and so forth. Uh, for this example, I'm going to use Google Drive and then I'm going to click on add right here. So once I do that, you can see that it opens up uh, a mini web browser and you can see that uh, there's my, already my email address which appears right here. But in case uh, it is not entered, then you might have to enter that out. So now I'm going to click on my email address right here. And then here it says Adobe Acrobat wants to access your Google account. So you have to click on allow for Adobe Acrobat Reader to access your content. So in my case, I'm going to click on allow. And what happens is that over here in the file section, there's Google Drive. So now I can see all the files associated with Google Drive right here. And if I were to double click some file, let's say for example, if I want to work around with uh, this tutube.jpz, you can see that as I double click it, it asks me where I want to actually save that file. So I can download uh, the file from Google Drive from over here as well. But let's say I want to save out a PDF. So I'm going to go around into uh, the recent document right here and I'm going to open out uh, this document and now to save this in Google Drive I need to go around into file and then I need to go around over here and then save this out So I'm just going to save this around uh, I can go to save the, uh, save as and then I can choose Google Drive and this appears once you add in your Google Drive account or any other cloud account of your choice so over here I'm just going to hit save and save it in the root folder and now what happens is that it saves the book one.pdf file in the Google Drive account. And now if I were to go to home and if I were to go around to Google Drive right here, let's see what happens. So it's loading out right here. And then here you can see that there's book one.pdf right there. And that is how you can work around with adding a cloud storage account inside of Adobe Acrobat Reader. And that is how you can access and save uh, the cloud files uh, um, from within Adobe Acrobat Reader. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.